Donating a kidney is not an easy choice to make, but for Sheridan Aspinwall, the choice was simple. I think a transplant can just be so transformative for people. And so being able to give 20 years of higher quality life and just giving time back in their day to someone, to me, seemed like a no-brainer. Sheridan is a clinical research nurse in the thoracic oncology department at Dana-Farber Cancer Institute. A 26-year-old Georgian native in good health, Sheridan decided to become a non-direct kidney donor, meaning she donated her kidney to a complete stranger. She says her experience as a nurse helped her make the decision to give back. I think anyone who has sort of been in a position of vulnerability before in a medical setting and has depended on someone um, knows that there is such an extraordinary gift to, to feeling that someone is, is caring for you and, and looking out for you. And the, the health risks to me are, are really low, especially comparing that to, you know, how much you can give to someone. The only thing Sheridan knows about her donation is that they had to fly her kidney to the recipient. She says one day she might have the chance to meet them. They give everyone a couple months to get some emotional distance from the surgery. And then at that point, ask both parties if they'd like to exchange contact info and learn more about each other. And if we both do, I mean, I would love to meet them. And even though Sheridan calls her decision a no-brainer, her friends and family have told her it takes special bravery and generosity to be a kidney donor. Sheridan says her work at Dana-Farber played a part in her decision and inspires her every chance she gets. It's just a really um, special place to inhabit in patients' lives. If I am able to do that and, and sort of take burden of the complexity of a clinical trial, off of a patient so that they can just focus on getting better, um, then I think I've done my job.